How to know an inside forward. This video is how to know an inside forward. I will be showing you what you need to know when it comes to an inside forward and the kind of attributes you need to be looking at for and the kind of road trait you should be looking at for. So I'm going to be circling them around. Now this is an inside forward. The natural inside forward, 21 years old, 64 million pounds value on 7.7250 7, key wages and his contract expires 2015. He's happy, he's young star, squad status is young star, and every single thing. Now this is a young player. Now, this type of young players, they are very, very good when you bring them into your team at the age of 18, 19, 20, and they develop to 21, 22, they already develop like this. Now, this is a player, at the age of 21, his star is already four and a half. This is, cr sometimes it's crazy because to see this type of players, it's gonna be hard. But now, how do you know an inside forward? What gives you the criteria when it comes to finding an inside forward? One, you have to look at dribbling. <clears throat> And you have to look at passing. You can see his passing is 19. Obviously, you should be looking at passing of like 15, 14. It's not bad. If you bring a young player like 20, 21, and his passing is 14 or 13, he can develop. So it's I think inside forwards are easy, easy to develop than any other position in when it comes to football manager mobile. When it comes to football, like in general. Now you look at um, passing, his passing has to be like 17. Obviously, you can get a player that is 20, 21, 22, and his passing is like 15 or 14. It's still not bad. Now, look at his shooting. Shooting is it really compulsory. I would say mm, not really compulsory, but it's good to have an inside forward that has a very good shooting. 14. 13, 15, good one. You can buy this type of players. Now, someone asks technique. Yes, you have. You can get a player that has technique, but technique would not be the important one to get when it comes to an inside forward. Technique is needed, but not as important in an inside forward. I don't know whether you understand what I'm saying. That's it. Now, the next thing you have to look at is creativity. Now, creativity really doesn't improve, but it improves on its own in, a, in an inside forward. But the high chance of your creativity increasing is, um, let's just say, 30, 35 percentage. But any other thing, maybe they can increase, but creativity doesn't increase. Now, Decision. Decision can be 15, 14, maybe 16. Really not that important, but hmm. leadership, oh no, not that important. But movement. Now, when you see there's a difference between technique and movement. Technique is different from movement. Very, very different. There's a very big difference. But movement is the one that an inside world really needs more than technique. Now, technique is, yes, getting an inside forward with a good technique probably is good. I'm not saying that it's bad. But movement is key to an inside forward. An inside forward needs movement as an important one. Like, when it comes to movement in an inside forward, it's really, really important. So, another one is teamwork. Now, teamwork can be 15, 14, maybe 16, because sometimes you really need your inside forward to be able to do the runs when it comes to the flanks. So, now, the next thing has to be pace. Look at pace. Really, really important. Pace is really, really important when it comes to um, your inside forward, but it's not that important. You can get an inside forward with like 14 or 15 pace in stand. But it's 
really important. You should not get an insight for order like 12 or 11 because they really need to be fast and understand. Yeah. Now, stamina, the same thing goes. You need stamina, really, really important. Strength, the same thing, really, really important. But it might not be as important as movement, but you still need your inside force to have like this stamina and strength, the ability to be strong and durable, you understand? So, now, another thing, you go to personality. Now, personality has to be capable under pressure and hard working. Now, it doesn't really show here capable under pressure or hard working, but I think hard, this player is a hard working player because how you know a hard working player is his teamwork and his stamina. Really, really good, but just has to live like that. If you want to know a player with a good hard working, like a player that is hard working, sorry. Is his teamwork and his stamina. Now, you go to the road trait. You see, get into a position area, moves into channels, likes to try to beat outside trap, cuts inside. Cuts inside, really important. Really, really important. Very, very important that you get a player, an inside forward, that knows how to cut inside and knows how to like, knows how to. Um, beat the offside trap, gets into a position area. These are really, really important road traits that you need, that your inside forward needs. Now, when it comes to the scout, you have to not say scout report, but let me let me show you. Coach report, what scout report, you understand? Now, coach report, a good dribbler, makes intelligent runs, good pass of the ball, Fiscally strong, understand? These are really important things when it comes to your inside forward. Make intelligent runs, good dribbler, and good pass out the ball. Those three are important when you're finding the right inside forward for your formation. Really, really important. Don't be naive not to understand that these are inside forwards. They have to be creative. Even if they are not creative as much, but they have to be creative. You you can see they have to be hitting 15 or 16. The formations, or the formation I have right now, the formation that depends on my inside forwards creating more than being the one that's scoring. I've done a video that my inside forward was scoring more goals than being creative so you can go and watch the video i'll put the video down below and you guys can watch the video obviously i want you guys to comment down below what road treat or what other video should i do and i will be doing that video for you guys i hope you enjoyed this video and take care of yourself thank you guys